For the second year in a row, a group called Disabling Barriers has granted nearly a million dollars to a handful of charities in the Pikes Peak region that focus on serving children and young adults with disabilities. Many of them you've heard of, Special Olympics, The Ark, Goodwill. But tonight we're highlighting one you may not be familiar with, Ainsley's Angels. Their mission, with new support from Disabling Barriers, is absolutely Colorado. Wakes up saying race. Yeah. It's Adrian. Yes. How are you? Yeah. Inclusion's a beautiful thing. Getting to see the joy and the athlete riders being excited to get rolling in the chairs, there's nothing better than that. You ready to race? Let's go fast. You ready? Adrian and Ella are on a practice run through Memorial Park with a few other teams brought together by Ainsley's Angels. Ainsley, born in 2003 in North Carolina, was diagnosed very early with a rare neurological disorder. But she lit up whenever her parents entered road races. And although she passed in 2016, her story inspired families across the country to create their own chapters, connecting runners with riders, hey, William. even providing the special racing chairs, which most parents couldn't afford on their own. The ultimate goal for us is for the families of the athlete riders to show up. We have the chairs ready for them. We have the angel runners paired up with them, and it's a chance for them to either roll with their athlete rider or to just enjoy watching the race. And as a parent of an athlete rider, local ambassador Jennifer Kent understands the benefit for them too. You know, there's a lot of work put into being a parent of someone with a disability, so we want to make this as easy for them as possible. It was hard for us to say no. Chris Robinson is the president of Disabling Barriers, which gave Ainsley's Angels $30,000 this year, some of which will pay for more chairs to support more athletes of all shapes and sizes. It's direct impact right down to the end user, and that's what we're all about. I cry almost every time we see the chairs roll across the start line. Ainsley's Angels entered six athlete riders into the St. Patrick's Day 5K. The group takes on everything from 5Ks to half marathons, even triathlons. The runners lending their legs to the athletes, allowing them to be a part of something they otherwise could not. One of the primary goals of disabling barriers. There's always going to be unmet needs and we can't I, we're not big enough to, to attack them all, but we're going to attack as many of them as we can. Over the past few years, the local chapter of Ainsley's Angels has grown, and Jennifer hopes that as more people learn about the nonprofit, even more of her angels will fly. Our goal is to have all of our chairs filled up, to have, you know, 15 chairs rolling at a race. You did it. That would be a dream come true for us. If you or someone you know would like to be a part of Ainsley's Angels as a runner or a rider, just a sponsor, there's an easy way to make that connection through the group's website. You can find a link to that one right now on ours, KRDO.com.